the future arena, Lithuania took on the USA in men's preliminary Group B of the goalball event. Lithuania and the USA were unbeaten going into this one. It was the USA who opened up the scoring through Joseph Hamilton, and then they extended their lead when Tyler Merrin scored for a 2-0 lead. Lithuania banked back as Grenik Pavlyukinek nabbed the team's first goal, swiftly followed by Justice Pazaruskas before Pavlyukinek struck again to put Lithuania 3-2 up. With Lithuania scoring once more, the USA needed to respond, and they did so through Hamilton as he secured a hat-trick to level the match at 4-all at half-time. The second half saw the match ebb and flow as the score went to five apiece. USA then leveled through Merrin to tie at six apiece. And so it went on. Grenik Pavlyukinek putting Lithuania in front for USA to level, this time through Hamilton, seven all. However, with time running out, Pavlyukinek bagged his seventh goal without reply from the USA. Lithuania taking the match, 8-7. In the women's preliminary event, the People's Republic of China took on Turkey in Group D. Turkey got off to the best possible start, going 2-0 up inside the first three minutes through Sevda Altanoluk. Turkey extended their lead once again, Altanoluk on the score sheet, making it 4-0. China found the back of the net through Zhang Wei for their first goal. Two more from Turkey and Altanoluk for 6-1. Despite China getting one back, it was not enough as Turkey took the match 7-2. In the men's preliminary pool A, Germany took on Canada. Germany currently undefeated, Canada in search of their first win. Canada got off to a great start going 2-0 up after 11 minutes of play and then made the lead 4-1 when Blair Nesbitt found the back of the net. A rally from Germany brought them back to 3-4 as Michael Feisler scored a hat-trick. Another goal from Feisler after Canada had bagged their fifth made the score 4-5. Canada scored next from the hands of Brendan Gowlin and despite Germany getting one back, it was Gowlin once again with his seventh goal to give Canada the victory 7-5.